Hello, everyone. Welcome to our show, Creative World. I'm your host, Shin Matsuba. We'll be introducing some amazing, talented people, chatting with them in a one-on-one interview, hearing their stories, picking their brains, looking through the kaleidoscope of Creative World. Today's Creative World is music. Today's guest is a very talented percussionist. Since he graduated from Berklee College of Music as a scholarship student, he has performed with other famous artists in Japan and the United States. Not only does he perform percussion at many venues, but he also participates in recording soundtracks of famous video games such as Final Fantasy as a percussionist. Moreover, he will be in an off-Broadway musical as an actor. I'm so happy to have this multi-talented guest on this show. Please welcome Takafumi Nikaido. Hello, Takafumi. Thank you very much for joining us today. Hello. Yoroshiku onegai shimasu. Yoroshiku onegai shimasu. I heard that a performance of Earth, Wind, and Fire inspired you to play percussion. Do you still remember how you felt and is that still motivating you? Yes, I still remember about that. The performance blew me away. Actually, it was the first time to sing percussionist. He was singing and dancing all the time, and his sound and group makes me dancing until end of the concert. It was really, really impressive. Definitely, his performance is motivating me, and I learned so many things from his performance. If I don't enjoy performance, audience can't enjoy performance either. The performance always reminded me about that. And last year was a very difficult year for a lot of people. However, is there anything from the past year that influenced you and your music in a positive way? Honestly, it was really, really difficult year for me too. All the event is postponed or canceled, but I've started post uh, my performance videos on social media and people react to my video and I could connect and collaborate also with so many musicians all over the world. I know you have performed at many venues, but what was the most memorable performance for you? C could you tell us more about it? Uh, most memorable performance was a uh, competition and concert. It's called Fiesta del Tambor 2014 in Cuba. Uh, I performed 10 minutes percussion solo in front of over 1,000 people. And I was really nervous because I played the traditional instruments, conga, in front of Cuban people. But when I finished my solo, they gave me a standing ovation. And yeah, this is one of the really, really good memory. As you have collaborated with many world-renowned artists, who was the most interesting person? And do you have any anyone who you would like to collaborate in the near future? Yes. Um, he's a 14 times Grammy Award winner, uh, Maestro Paquito de Rivera, saxophonist from Cuba. Uh, I've listened to his music since when I started playing percussion at age of seven. I met him at his workshop in Berkeley College of Music in 2014. And this year, finally, I had an opportunity to collaborate with him with a remote recording. Uh, his composition and arrangement are so beautiful and I can hear the percussion group from his melody. I've been really happy and honored to be part of this project and I hope to continue performing with him. I would like to collaborate with Maestro Michel Camilo, one of the best pianists from Dominican Republic, and Gonzalo de Barcaba, He's also a pianist from Cuba. Please tell me how the music group called Mix Class started. Do you think the group will perform outside Boston in the future? Yes. Uh, Mix Class is a play on words and a play on sounds from three different cultures to achieve a truly unique Afro-Cuban jazz experience. Uh, we met in Berkeley Culture Music and we have been playing together for seven years. Mixcla is led by pianist uh, Sayuri Gonzalez Zamora from Cuba. 
and bassist Gerson Lasso Quiroga from Chile, and myself on percussion. Uh, we have performed internationally in various events, such as the uh, Montreal Jazz Festival in Canada and Monterey Jazz Festival in California. And yes, uh, we are planning to do an uh, album release tour. Uh, please check our Facebook page, Mixgla. M-I-X-C-L-A, Mixgla. And what do you think is necessary to succeed internationally? We have so many things to do, um, but I think we need to be flexible for everything. We're gonna have come up against the brick wall, but we need to flexible mind to resolve the problem and move forward. I think this is really important, not only for musicians, but also everybody. And please tell me how you feel about being an actor in an off-Broadway musical called The Visitor. Are, are there any other new challenges that you look forward to this year? I passed audition as a percussionist who is one of the playing African drum. It's called Jembe on the stage. Uh, when rehearsal started, a uh, music director asked me, Hey Taka, can you sing it? Then I said, of course because I'm singing a uh, backing chorus in Spanish when I perform with Sazman. After the uh, choreographer also asked me, Hey Taka, can you dance with us? Then I said, of course. Well, actually I never, I never danced since the uh, school art festival at the age of the 10. But I really want to challenge because everything is new to me. Unfortunately, the show has postponed, but I believe the show coming back soon. And new things, I just start uh, recording at my house from this year. I'm still studying how to do that, but I can't wait. I just can't wait to collaborate with talented musicians all over the world. Oh, and I also just opened the YouTube channel. So I will post my collaborate videos. Please check and subscribe my channel if you like. And the last question, the title of this show is Creative World. So what does the word creative mean to you? What is your own interpretation for the word creative? Okay, so creative is be yourself. So be yourself, how you hear, how you taste, how you feel. Everybody has own opinion. And some people agree with me, but maybe some people don't. The people who agree with me, we can share many things in common. But the people who don't agree with me, I can learn many things from different pers perspectives. So we don't need to be afraid to be different. Creative is be yourself. I see. Don't be afraid to be different and be flexible. That's great. Thank you very much, Takafumi. Today's guest was Takafumi Nikaido, who is a very talented percussionist active internationally. Thank you. Thank you so much. Arigatou gozaimasu. Now, Takafumi has some interesting materials. Enjoy. Ghibli Park featuring Studio Ghibli Animation will open in Aichi. It is inspired by Ghibli films such as Howl's Moving Castle and Spirited Away, directed by Hayao Miyazaki. Enjoy the world of films. A Whisker Away was released worldwide on Netflix. The setting for the story is along the pottery footpath in Aichi. Visit Aichi and see the spots appear in the movie. See you in Aichi! Some say there's no need to reinvent the wheel. Sure. Unless you can make it better. All tires aren't created equal. The Nitto Ridge Grappler. Spiral wound construction enables our truck tires to be aggressive and ride incredibly smooth. Our tread and sidewall designs deliver off-road performance for even the most demanding terrain while computer-simulated tread design delivers a quiet and comfortable ride on the highway. The Ridge Grappler goes beyond expectations. 
Nitto Tire, fueled by enthusiasts. All right, thank you so much for watching my interview today. Now I'd like to show you my previous performance videos. Uh, first video is my band Mix Club. Uh, we have been playing together since 2013, and we're planning to do tour soon. Uh, please check our Facebook page, Mix Club, M I X C L A. And second video is project with Maestro Paquito de Rivera. I'm really honored to participate in this project. Thank you so much, Maestro. And we did remote recording from each house. So I hope you guys enjoy. Again, thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching my interview today. And my performance, performance video will be uploaded on my YouTube channel. So please check and subscribe it. I hope to see you soon. Wait, wait, there's part two. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel.